I started my business, I want to say in 2018. I stay home and take care of my grandma. She's 85, retired, and she just needs a little extra help right now. Also stayed with my son for the first few years of his life, and it was just an extra income for me. So, you know, I slowly started showing pictures on Facebook of what I've done, or some people would message me and say, hey, this is what I would like. That started beating, I wanna say I was around like 11 when I started taking interest into it. I didn't really start beating beating until I was in my teenage years. My mom and my grandma and my brother, I had grown up watching them bead, watching them make their own outfits for powwows. And so it piqued a huge interest in me to be able to do beadwork for people and beadwork for my family since they're the ones that have always made my outfit and beaded for me. The beadwork that I do is more plain style, is more my shine wrap side. There are times that I do Cherokee designs. I mean, I am tarot certified to do all types of crafts that I was taught. With our beading, you know, my great grandpa beaded his mom, his grandma, it went down the line. And my grandma started beading for her kids and for her husband. And then she taught her kids and her kids also learned from their grandparents too. So it's just kind of neat because it, my mom taught me, but my grandma also taught me who was taught by her in-laws who, you know, it just kind of went back and forth. It's important to me because, you know, I powwow. I mean, I haven't gone to powwows since the pandemic hit, but you know, I want to be able to one day look at my son and say, I beaded his outfit. I want my son to be able to, you know, one day say, hey, my mom taught me how to do this and I'm doing it for my children. And then I want their children to say the same thing that their dad taught them this because his mom taught him this. It's so important to me because it's like with our outfits, it's family designs. It's designs given to us. Most people have tribal designs, like you know what tribe they're from. And to me, it's important because I want people to still continue to be able to say, oh, that person's from this tribe. I want them to be able to recognize that, hey, you know, her son comes from this family because of his designs. It's just important to me because it's how we're identified in a sense. And I just find it important to continue that because I, it's something close to me.